This is your NBC 26 News Update. I'm Caroline Hogan. Regulators have given the green light for kids to get Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine. The director of the CDC si signed off on the lower dose COVID vaccine for children ages 5 to 11. This decision comes hours after a unanimous vote to recommend the vaccine by a CDC advisory panel. This now allows more than 28 million children to start receiving their vaccines. At their annual luncheon, the Green Bay Packers Foundation awarded $1 million in grants to local organizations. The grant money was awarded to 274 civic and charitable organizations, with a focus this year on arts and culture, athletics, and education. Groups receiving the money said it would go a long way in our community. And the Atlanta Braves are World Series champs. It's their first World Series title since 1995. The Braves defeated the Astros 7 to nothing in game six last night. The team once again homered their way to an early lead. Jorge Soler is now the fourth Brave to have three home runs in a single World Series. He joins Hank Aaron, Lonnie Smith, and Ryan Klesko. The entire state of Wisconsin is below freezing here this morning. We're starting off into those 20s right now with wind chills into the teens. We're going to warm up slowly into those low 40s today with mostly sunny skies, calmer winds out of the west, but it's going to actually be feeling more like the upper 30s for us once you factor in that wind chill. So winter weather advisory is that Lake Effect snow machine is still turned on at Lake Superior. A few flurries are possible to could fly through the North Woods, but no accumulations expected. Nothing like Kent and Michigan getting nearly a foot of snowfall out there. As we look at Ironwood, Michigan, four inches looks very bright and in my opinion, beautiful. But how's this for you? Weekend forecast. Oh boy, we are warming things up to the upper 50s by Saturday, low 60s by Sunday with sunny skies.